what has been your greatest joy in ministry? And he, he was like, he said, seeing people get saved because there's nothing more fulfilling in life knowing that a person is going to spend eternity with Jesus Christ. Oh, being completely honest, what is the most difficult thing for you in ministry is finding the time to spend with God. The biggest thing in multiple in multiple questions was uh, being consistent in your prayer life and being consistently in the uh, Word. Something that he said that I was just very, like I, I'd never heard before, um, was some churches do music very well and some do worship very well. Conversation is don't ever let music get in front of worship and don't let your talent come before your character. Mm. Each of the guys just really emphasized um, keeping the job out of your spiritual life. So, I mean, he started off the email by saying, don't do this unless you have to. If there was a, a theme that I could pick between all of them, it would probably be uh, humility. One of the biggest challenges, people. Mm -hmm. Everyone said people, or people, people. It was what, wow. Why did he say people? Yeah, because people are difficult, people are hard, the volunteers, some volunteers don't know what ministry is about. And uh, then he had three words for me. He said, privilege, you're privileged to be in ministry, um, sacrifice. You're going to sacrifice more than you actually pay, probably. And he said, authentic place. Like, as they both said, like, maintain your spiritual, like, mm -hmm. your spiritual disciplines. Mm -hmm. And he said for the first two years, he was so focused on others, he forgot about his own um, relationship, so his relationship mm -hmm. with God as well as other people, um, mm -hmm. to where that he wasn't doing a study time and stuff. Um, and he said, like, you need to constantly be in prayer, and you need to have that relationship with God before your ministry. Well, I hear you all say, based on your interviews, is that the relationship with God is absolutely essential. The second thing would be your relationship with others, people. people. You know, just dealing with people. And then the third thing, it sounds like, is family. I was going, wow, that's so fascinating. 200 years of experience. And all three of those can be the greatest blessing or the greatest difficulty. With God. They only mention, hey, make sure you keep this in front of you because they realize how important it is and how maybe difficult it is. As you all move forward in your own personal ministry ambitions and careers, you know, God, others, and family, it's going to be hard, but it's also become the greatest blessings you've ever experienced.